We have information about the Galaxy A56, the successor to the famous Galaxy A55, as records have appeared in Geekbench that give us to know the power that would have the processor and also details of the processor and RAM memory that this device will have. Apparently someone performed four tests on the same day with this device. And the maximum score achieved in all these tests was 1,353 in single core and 3,847 points in multi-core. And just so that you more or less have a reference of this performance, it would be above the Snapdragon 7 Gen 3 and more or less on par with the Snapdragon 8 plus Gen 1. So definitely this new generation will have a pretty powerful processor that will be more than enough for the vast majority of users. But as I told you a moment ago, the most important thing in Galaxy devices is usually always RAM. And that's where Samsung tends to falter a lot. But in this Galaxy A56, they're reportedly going to incorporate 8 gigabytes of RAM. So that's excellent news because we're going to have good RAM, good processor and of course good ruggedness and good build as we usually see in this series. And you might be wondering, what's the processor that's going to be built in? Well it is the Exynos 1580, a processor that according to the information published has a cluster of 4 cores at 1.95 GHz and another of 3 cores at 2.6 GHz. Finally, the last cluster has a single 2.91 GHz core, and obviously it's also going to incorporate a new GPU for better gaming performance. So we are talking about a very important improvement and evolution in power specifically with this device that is surely going to be the favorite of many next year. But remember that leak is not presentation, so let's wait until the official presentation that usually should happen in March or April.